Good morning, Lauren. It's Monday and there's only 17 weeks until we can face touch IRL. So that was creepy. I'm sorry. Thing is, the face touching is completely normal between us now in our friendship, so I felt like it was right. So that's a thing. Our friendship is particularly strange because we didn't have the conventional start that most friendships have. And when I tell people that my friend from America is coming to visit in August, they always ask me the same question. So how did you meet? And then I have to give them the dreaded answer, which can end in one of about 10 ways. It's usually shock and horror, because how did we meet? We met via the internet. And telling people that you met over the internet can freak them out a little bit because they still think that it's kind of strange that two people met via the internet. I think had we been in closer proximity, then it may not have been as weird, but the fact that you live, you know, all in Tennessee and everything, and I live all over in England and everything, I think people are like, Okay. Not only that, but you then have to give them the story of how we met, which is through the nerd fighting, which led to the awkward nods, which led to VidCon, which led to Nashville last year, and then everything else in between. And unless you're with people who understand YouTube and the way the community works, then people don't often understand. But then again, I think that's one of the many perks of our friendship because it is unconventional and it is strange how we met. But you know what? It makes for a awesome story. And the fact that we began talking in late 2010, which you know is like three and a half years ago now, and we're still talking now, and we're still really good friends, I think it's amazing because it shows that you can meet people from all over the world and have amazing things in common and it's just great. Like my friends Claire and Emma who live in Australia but we met in London over a glass of wine and they're still two of my closest friends. Or all the other awesome people that you meet and become really good friends with across the country like at YouTube gatherings like I went to on Saturday and I met up with people who I hadn't seen for a while and it was lovely. I'm gonna make a proper video about YouTube in the community and why it is still so important even though recent goings on have made it look quite bad. Uh, I'm gonna do that over on my main channel though but I just wanted to talk about us and our friendship and how awesome it is and how I treasure it so much. Because it is unconventional and it is weird, but it's great because we have the most fun I'm pretty sure you feel the same about our friendship And I'm 95% sure you've had the same amount of weird looks as I got when you had to explain how we met when you explain it to people IRL So that's pretty much it for this week. I hope you get your passport sorted out I know you're currently having some troubles with that, but I hope it all goes well And I'm so be so excited when you get it have an awesome time in New York with your brothers and say hi to Jonathan and Braden for me and I hope you're well and I hope you're having a lovely week. DFTBA and I'll see you next Monday.